Hello and Assalamualaikum everybody Welcome back to the channel One here your resident guitar player Slash M tester for the day Coming to you from Cheritun HQ Down in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia And today we have this <laughs> About a couple of months back I did the um, The 100 watt version of it And today we've gotten The smaller version of it It's not smaller <laughs> um, Size wise it's not <laughs> Power wise is yes. So yeah, this is the 50 watts version of um, OTS HRM model. So that's the 50 watts equipped with a C later unit. So C later unit is a uh, tube buffered effects loop unit. Um, yeah. So it's designed to um, accept or not really accept. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. I guess so. Yeah. From from my understanding is um, you plugged in into your um, you plug your effects, especially your chorus, your modulation, time base effects, into this so that it plays nice with the effects loop of this. <laughs> so yeah, especially the vintage ones. Uh, the modern one you can select the input and output level, but yeah, especially the vintage ones, um, you kind of have to like um, kind of have to use this so that it plays nice in the effects loop of this. So yeah, that's the nutshell. <laughs> In a nutshell, that's what it is to me though. Um, again, any questions, direct them to Nick. <laughs> so yeah, so this is the um, HRM 50 watts, uh, OTS HRM 50 watts uh, with a bunch of mods in it. So it does have, at the back, it does have a half and full power switch. It is select to full because I like it. <laughs> and um, at the back as well, it has a um, um, negative feedback toggle switch. So right now it is switched into stop mode. So if I'm not mistaken, it is into stop mode because I didn't touch it. <laughs> so, and the other one is a, a post phase inverter master volume. So it's PPIMV for short. Um, it's set to full, so it's bypass. Um, you have your effects loop send and return, your passive effects loop send and return, and also OD trim at the back. So right now the OD trim is at one o'clock. So I'm not going to touch it. So leave it be. So let's take a look at the front. Aha! So there's a high and low input. Um, I'm going to be plugging in into the high input for the rest of the video. Um, we have your volume with pull bright switch air, uh, pull bright knob there. So it is pulled, so bright engage. It's at 11 o'clock right now. Dip switch is at the down position, it's off. Mid boost is an up, on. Rock and jazz is on the up, so it's on the rock position. Treble is at um, one o'clock. Middle is at 10 o'clock. Bass is at 10 o'clock. Drive and level is also at 10 o'clock, as well as master. Presence is at one o'clock. So. Yeah, so this this small toggle switch over here, this is for your HRM tone defeat, uh, HRM defeat tone step. So right now is on the down position. So I'll flick through it throughout um, because it's only it's only applicable on the drive section. So yeah, we'll 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 have a taste of it later on. Um, on the C later. So right now the settings I have on the C later is roughly Unity. So, in theory, it shouldn't have a lot of difference volume-wise. Yeah, but before we started the video, I did check the um, wave level between those two, whether it's on or off. So, it, this, is, this is where I got it, roughly Unity. So, um, you can use this as your preferred starting point. By all means, please do so. Yeah. So, this is where... Right now, it's um, when I check just now before we started the video, um, wave-wise or volume-wise, it's almost the same. So yeah, the drive is at twelve o'clock. In is a ten thirty-ish, I guess. It's about yeah. It's no, sorry, not ten. So <laughs> excuse me. It's two thirty. Uh, yeah. So right now, out is at three o'clock. Both bright switches are on the bypass position, so this is down and this is in the middle. So, yeah, there's a lot of options here. Um, yeah, 
So that's the amp. So I mean, that's another usage for oscillator. In uh, you know, apart from you know making your time based and modulation based effects play nice with the amp, it serves also as another tone shaping tool for this amp. And also, it can act as a master volume as well. But right now, I am not using it for that. I'm using it for tone coloration. So yeah. <clears throat> so that's it. <laughs> that's the amp. So okay. Um, going into the amp is my ES three three five stock with no um, trouble bleed in the volume knob whatsoever. So you'll hear if I turn it, turn the guitar volume down. You can hear how the guitar and the amp reacts. Yeah. So from the guitar goes to the amp. From the amp goes into our two by twelve close back cabinet equipped with WGS ET65 speakers in it with one of the speakers is mic'd with an SM57 right on the grill going into the interface and straight into logic and that's the chain that's the guitar that's the amp and this is me I am gonna stop yapping and we're gonna start playing <laughs> was just the clean channel with nothing in it I mean this is still bypass um, yeah that's just the clean channel and just my guitar controlling dynamics and all that so let's take a look at the um, preambles so yeah With again. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's just switch it off. Let's go to the drive section. So, bear in mind. The HRM is still 
uh, on the down position. So, yeah. <laughs> volume about halfway so that's five all right so hrm don't stack switch all the way up volume have we So now, vol um, HRM switch in the middle, volume knob both halfway. So, yeah. <laughs> gonna put it back on the down position because yeah that's why I like it let's put on the boost Thank <laughs> you. 
So now, the um, sealator is plugged in. So this is the clean sound. So, neck, neck pickup, and this is... that um, it sounds a, a little bit darker than before so let's um, introduce this the bright switch so still that darkness I like it let's just try that, that br the first bright switch going up position so <laughs> Instantly, you get a lot more gain <laughs> on your clean sound. <laughs> so, bright switch all the way to the bottom. Let's try flick on the second bright switch all the way to the up position and see how that sounds. You get a little bit more extra on the highs. Not too much, just nice. Bypass all the bright. Let's go to the drive. Instantly, when you plug this in, it adds a little bit more gain and a little bit more sustain. 
switch on the up position switch the first one go up position with the preamp boost <laughs> why not folks for the um, for the HRM OTS HRM 50 with the C later <laughs> that's it for this week folks thank you so much for staying all the way to the end um, yeah again if you have any questions any inquiry about this M or any other M's that we have uh, please do email them at, uh, to nick at chariotone.com that's the email or if you just want to browse through the catalog and see what other what are the M's that we have to offer Please do check it out at um, www.cherryton.com. That's the website. And again, folks, thank you so much. Please do comment, a like, and subscribe to the video. Um, please do share them across your social media platform. That will help us a lot. Thank you so much. Um, and again, folks, that's it for this week. Um, yeah, this week. <laughs> um, one here, your resident guitar player slash am tester. Signing off for the day. Assalamualaikum and bye bye folks. See you next one.